Hi everyone, in this video I will show you how you can fix the blender keeps crashing on your PC. So guys I will show you the 5 effective solution that you need to apply to fix this problem and right click on your blender launcher and go to its properties. Then go to its compatibility tab and now here check this box of the run the program in compatibility mode. And choose the windows 8 from here and check this box of the disable full screen optimization and run as administrator. So now your blender will run in the compatibility mode and these are the very important settings that you need to apply to fix this problem. After that just restart your PC and your problem is fixed. And guys if your problem is not fixed, right click on your taskbar and open up your task manager. Now guys from here you just need to disable or the close all the background application running here. So because the useless application is running here in the task manager causes the blender crashing. Then go to the startup here you just need to uh, disable all the applications you are seeing here. Why? Because this application start automatically when you start your PC and cause the lot of the CPU usage, RAM usage or the, or the bandwidth usage of your computer which causes the blender crashing when you open the blender. So all you need to do is just disable all of these applications as you can see I have already disabled this application right click on that simply click on the disable so guys you just need to make sure you don't disable this real tech hdr manager or the windows security notification which is the important after that just restart your pc and your problem is fixed if your problem is not fixed then you just need to check if you have the minimum or the recommended requirement to run the blender and guys here you can see the minimum or the recommended requirement so make sure you have the 8 GB RAM or the Windows 10 to run the Blender. So if you have it, then you also just need to make sure that your Blender is up to date. After that, the next setting we need to do is go to the Windows I type hit the update and open it. If there is any available update, you can simply update your operating system. You also just need to make sure that your Graphic card is out to date. Go to the Windows or type at the device manager and open it. Now you will see your graphic cards and the display adapters option like this. Just open it, you will see the graphic card and just update your graphic card. If you have the NVIDIA or AMD graphic card, you can simply open up the software and update your graphic card because it play an important role to run the blender. If your problem is not fixed, then you can go to the Windows setup at the view advanced settings. Open it here. You just need to go to the advanced tab, click on the settings. Now go to the advanced and click on the change. Now we are going to increase our virtual memory. Uncheck this box of the aut automatically manage paging size. Click on the custom size and choose at the local disk C. And in the initial size, just type the memory which I show you. So how to calculate the memory you can open up the calculator and if you have the 8 GB of RAM then you can multiply it with the constant value which is the 1024. So it will basically increase your RAM. So you can just copy this value and just paste in the initial size. And then you can multiply this value with the 3 and this can give you the maximum size. So you can just copy this value and just paste in the maximum size. If you have the 16 GB RAM then you can multiply the 16 with the 1024 and then multiply with the 3 and just paste in the and just copy and paste in the sizes then just click on the set click on the ok then it will ask you for the restart then you just simply need to restart your PC and your problem is definitely fixed. If your problem is still not fixed then you can go to the Windows set type at the graphic settings and you just need to make sure that your blender is on the high performance. Click on the blender, click on the option here. You can select it to high performance so it can use all the power of your graphic card. Click on the browse option and here you just need to locate where your blender launcher is. So just go to the location, select the blender launcher, click on the add. Here you can see it is already added. Click on the option, select it to high performance, then click on the save. After that, just restart your PC and your problem is definitely fixed. The last setting I recommend you go to the Windows set, type at the power plan and open it. 
Now from here just click on the power option you are seeing on the top and click on the choose what the power button to. Click on the change settings and here you just need to make sure that the turn on fast startup recommended is unchecked. Then save the changes and just restart your PC and I hope guys one of these solution work for you. And if yes please don't forget to like this video because this is only motivation for me. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye bye.